Hello everybody, welcome back to more Undermine Other Mind Streak in Time. We've got an interesting selection on the line. Uh, I mean, I feel like we just go with the Chaos Spawn, right? Like, it's... Do I love the Chaos Spawn? No, I don't love the Chaos Spawn. I do... Am I in love with the Chaos Spawn? Am I in love with the Chaos Spawn? Maybe. Maybe, we'll see. We have to, we, we just met, we need to get to know each other a little bit more, but uh, we gotta go with uh, either Bottle Lightning or Bishop Bomb. That is an interesting choice as well. I hate all these choices because they're kind of close. Like, it, I would definitely have picked Nico there. Uh, Bishop's Bomb is actually really, really solid. I think it's pretty darn good. I've really come to enjoy it a lot recently. It can be a very good tool to, uh, basically for exploration. Is it a good weapon? It can be as well, you know? You get yourself on a bomb run, and then, uh, then, then, baby, you got a stew going, right? But alas, huge shout out to Romulus for supporting on Patreon. A very, very generous support on Patreon. Getting your name on a peasant here and getting yourself a title at the end of this run. We'll try to get you one worthy of your generosity here. But for now, we don't have we don't have much. We got like good starts here in the sense that um, kind of like yesterday's run where we had a we have a pretty good swing throw combo scenario, uh, which is you know I'll, I'll take it. It's a very good beginning thing, and it also lets us kind of pivot into hey yo, lets us pivot into a couple different directions. Uh, we could go swing, we could go throw, we could stay in the swing throw combo lane though. We could do any of it. Any, any of it, we could do all of it. We could do none of it, we could do some of it. Here's the thing. God, I love swing speed. But I, I hate this curse more because I'll tell you what exactly will happen if we leave it on. I'll kind of forget that I have it literally every single time we run into a potion. So it could end up screwing us over. I mean, wor worst comes to worst, or like in a, in a terrible scenario. Well, well, in a terrible scenario, it could actually like kill us, you know? What if this paid out? <gasps> I mean, triple bombs for uh, the price of one key is good. It's, it is good. Don't get me wrong, this is going to sound very very, uh, very privileged and greedy, but it's not necessarily, like, extremely... <laughs> I don't know what my plan was there. It's not, like, an extremely good pickup or anything. It's just a, it's a nice get. It's a nice pickup. Like, I, they're, they're valued in the economy pretty darn you know pretty darn well i'd say i would say it's a good it's a good get but we definitely want to make sure we have enough keys to get anything we need early on boy i wish there was a cursed fire so i could have gotten value out of that stuff there genuinely it probably would have been a good idea to pick up the uh oh cool to pick up the old whatchamacallit anyways the uh the popcorn kernels i think that would have been a smart idea don't get me wrong it was a good, it was a good get. It was a good get. But I just wanted to, I more just wanted to segue that thought process into a, a talk. And that was about the value of keys versus bombs. Like, keys are certainly more valuable than bombs. One key to one bomb. However, if you have enough keys to open up things, you know, to open up everything you need, then at that point, bombs are better. So, uh, since we're early on, very, 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 very much in the beginning of the run here, and we don't know if we will get enough keys to open up everything we really want to open up, sans maybe, maybe four key rooms, I feel like, you know, we don't really need to care about those as much. They're very greedy. They are very greedy. They are, they're not there for you to, like, always open. I, they're there for the runs that are, hmm. We have bottled lightning, so on hit effect proc run, maybe. Bottled lightning and, and guidance, that's that's my current thought right now, is that we definitely could get a lot of value out of that. Uh, 
We will try. We will try. Can't make it happen, but we can definitely make decisions to, uh... Uh, oh. Yeah, ha, ha, hooey. We can definitely make some decisions to increase the likelihood of it happening. Uh, I'm gonna sell intensify. Ooh, I'm gonna sell intensifier, but not yet. Probably. We'll do it after because we have uh, we have Tuss up there. With Tuss, we wanna we wanna make sure we get down to his uh, the lowest amount of money possible. Do we waste all of our time here? Oh, it ain't no waste of time at all. We can pretty much just uh, lock that in there. Okay, here's the thing. Yes, we will get all this. We will do all that. We will pick up this. We'll pick up that. We'll pick up the gold or we'll sell the thing. Step one, spend all of our money. Hmm. Okay, step one, see if there's a curse in here. Hey, Macarena! That is fantastic. That is so ideal. That is so ideal. It ain't even funny, man. All right. God, that was such good luck. Such good luck. The whole run, we had not got any uh, bonus. Oops, what am I doing? Why can't I press the six key? I don't know why. <laughs> All right, on hit effect procs, uh, phantasmal axe are keys, key key items. Whap, whap. Mune. Oh, duplicator. Mmm. Inverter. These are some good things. I think we take duplicator. I think on other mine too, it is hard to argue something being much more valuable than duplicator. Uh, yes, it puts us in a situation where we might have to pass up an item or, or like basically delete an item from our pool because there's two really good items offered to us. But, you know, it's not that common. It, it is common enough to be worth talking about and it's common enough to be annoying however it's a pretty good problem to have <laughs> is oh man i have too many good items being offered to me that i can't get all of the good items it's a pretty it's a good scenario <laughs> it's a good scenario oh boy this is a good start i just i almost missed that there but hey don't care all right and we got a bonus 10% chance to find Omegalol through a very smooth, easy, breezy uh, curse removal there. Eh? Meat. Floor meat. Bip, bip. Good stuff with the on-hit effect procs. It'd be cool if there was an item. Like, it'd be maybe a little too niche or a little too complicated to explain. But if there was a thing that made it so on-hit effects... We're like twice as likely to proc or something. That'd be that'd be so broken. I'll take unstable concoction for sure. And all this being uh being said about the whole like keys, it it not being super worth it, the the four keys all the time. It is definitely a little bit more worth it on a day like today where we have unicorn horn and it's way. I did not. Oh my god, I did not notice. These guys trip me up when they spawn in the middle of a room like that. Because it's... Uh, the, the, the cackle is such a signature thing to let you know that they're in the room. And I know they play it. But I just... I, I listen for it at the start of the room. That's really... That's the big old thing there. Uh, yeah, right? I, uh, you know... It's tough. Those are both good. And I might like to do that. I might. We gotta be careful here. If we throw our pickaxe, it gonna hit the boy we don't want it to hit. 
this is a, this is the truth about the situation. All right, so next time we use a bomb or a key, we use this and we gain one of the other thing. Hey, this potion is just it's good enough, but it is not good that like today. It's not an all scenarios kind of a kind of a potion and I'm it's not really a too good to to use situation one either where we like will want to hold on to it. It ain't it ain't that good. Um, we could pick up the swing as well. It's 150. I'm gonna save my money though. There's been so many situations recently where uh, I think that the amount of stuff that we purchased, God, I... unstable concoction is a, is sleeper strong too. The amount of stuff we purchased, uh, probably like that we didn't quite need, is a little too high. A little too high. Throw speed on a ricochet run is very nice to pick up. Very nice to pick up. Cool. Funny thing about Ponzu, he's great to fight first. Okay, swing throw. I mean, he's a single target, so the ricochet situation is not really that beneficial until he summons his ads and even then like I don't even know if I'd consider it to be technically beneficial kind of is that we don't have to deal with them we don't have to worry about them as much but alas alas oh heck bup 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 almost not too worried bye bye Wonderful. Wonderful. Okay. I don't really want... I don't want armor in my pool right now. We did... We did a nice armor run, too. Oh, God. <laughs> 13... We have a 13% crit chance? How? Do we start with... 10? I want to remove these. Well, I want to remove... I, I'd like them both, God, but I want, I want to remove Waking Light, of course. Oh, hell. Wait. Come on. But I just realized there's no torch... Those are torches! Oh, come on. Those are torches. Are you sure? Are you sure about that? Uh, you know, it's cool that we got the extra curse in the sense that we increased our chance to find Omega Lull. That's great. Uh, but I, I really want that one, that one gone. All right. <clears throat> it's just a box, and I don't know if we're going to fill it up. Oh man, I don't. know. I kind of regret my choice. It's it's so it's such a good item. It's too good of an item. I'm well aware. Talk about it all the time. Hmm. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Hmm. All right. We should buy the bomb. Okie dokie. Okay, benefit of this uh, this here curse is this. Cool. If we didn't have this curse, we, whoa! we wouldn't have gotten that chest. We also would not have taken that damage. So it kind of, oh, there we are. Kind of evens out. Uh, even though it has benefit to it, I don't really feel like just playing around holding on to it. It's just kind of... It just it gives me anxiety. It's an annoying little thing. Bo -bo. Bo -bo -bo. I 
I see. Oh, oh come on. All right, give me a Megalo. Oh, I didn't. Ex I didn't actually expect it. You lovely, lovely creature. Um, what do I want? I don't know. Oh, why'd you do this to me? These these are both not very good. These are both not good at all. When it says carried bombs decrease swing and throw damage, it means if I have 10 bombs, I basically don't do swing or bomb damage. Or wait, swing or uh, throw damage. Whoops. That's pretty... It's kind of hard to pass up. And then Branding Bomb literally freaking hurts you. I... Those items need a rework. They are not... Legendary. What is happening? I'm getting... Epic Games Launcher? What the hell? What do you want, Epic Games? I'm not, I'm, I'm not playing on Epic Games. Why, why are you having issues? Don't talk to me. That's just such a disappointing. Uh, you know, of course, this is really good with um, Ursa Major, but I don't want to make this into an Ursa Major run, you know. Maybe we could get another Omegalo. Nope. Oh. Okay. Aye, aye, aye. Good enough. Good enough for me. I shouldn't have, I shouldn't risk it. You should just not throw your pickaxe when you have the bouncy with when they're in their room basically. Pretty much. We have so many bombs, I'm just feeling like just straight up face checking them all. Ah okay. Do do this is a very good potion, and I like to have it. This is a very good potion, and I like to have it. My brain just registered what that trade was. That's crazy. Boom, 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 boom. So. Wasn't, wait. No, that was on that side. I don't know. I don't know. Whoop. We can try to get Omegalol to show up again. That's my my current desire. Also, you know exactly what we would have wanted. We would have wanted Mjolnir. That would have been great. Yep. I can't believe I'm doing this. It's gonna get me get get me got. Oh, the explosive gold. Thank you very much. Oh, I don't really want that curse or that uh, that blessing. I'm not going to say it's useless because it absolutely is not useless. But I'm a I'm a stinky, silly man who wants to just increase my chance of getting Omega Wall. So I'm going to straight up pass up a swing damage upgrade. So it's a good pickup. But. Oh. See, that's a, right there, that's a room where I wanted both items. Poop, 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 poop. I think it's literally impossible to get Omega Lol right now, but maybe, maybe next floor? I can't remember what exactly it does. It's, I know that since I've started this sub-series, we, ooh, baby, that's nice. Since I've started this sub-series, we have not once gotten a, uh, Omega Lol twice in the same run. Not once have we gotten it twice. <laughs> Not once have we gotten it twice. The phrasing on that is a bit goofy, but you understand the idea regardless. That almost hit me anyways, kind of. All right. Basically, I'm looking for gold potion. You know what? Sure. 
We've not found our guaranteed shrine on this floor yet, so it's even more valuable to increase, you know, the options of what we're going to get. Especially since I'm probably going to uh, just, you know, I probably am going to use the blessing. You know, I'm going to generate a blessing instead of removing a curse. Because as annoying as it is that we have a throw damage down and a shot cost up, I don't know, I feel like we just... We just rock it to the grave, right? Rock it to the grave. Ooh. This is a bad idea. This is a fine idea. Could have been bad. I mean, it's... It's a really good thing that we have as many options for, or as many potion slots as we do. It makes it so that's not that big of a deal. How many potions do we really want to preserve in any given scenario? Really? More than one? Oh. Doesn't matter, though. Doesn't matter, though. I'm going to bury it. I'm going to bury it. That's okay. I'm, like, basically... I with major curses, I look at them and I'm like, would this be annoying if I had it for the entire game? And at that point, if if I answer yes, then I, I make it my life's goal to make sure it gets off of me. Otherwise, if it's like this where I'm like, is it annoying? Sure. But is it like really going to change that much? Not necessarily. I don't think, I, I don't think so. Again, if we had one less potion slot, it would be a completely different story. It'd be a completely different story. Not being able to pick up and use potions at all is way worse than only having one potion slot. Like, incalculably worse to me. Whip. 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 Should only be three... Thank you. Probably the best attack for him to do. It's really like... It ain't too bad to dodge. Can we kill here? I think we can kill here if he does five. Yep. Hilarious. I love getting Seer nowadays. Seer used to be so... Tough and annoying, but... Honestly, I think it's... I think it's the easy roll now. It's one of the easy rolls. I'm gonna be honest. I have more trouble with Nori. Um, we're actually in a prime contender for Holy Glaze territory, so I'll say sure to that. This is the question. Do I want to make it so we can't get an Omegalol item? No. That's right. I'm taking Garbo item instead of good item. I'm doing it. I'm just, today is the day where I just try and prove a point. <laughs> you know, I guess. What is that point? To, I don't even know. Uh, the fact that I will win regardless, I guess? I guess that's the fact. Or that's the point. Uh, I, I suppose. It's not really a point. Oh. But it's more that, yeah, like, I, I guess, maybe it's like putting my money where my mouth is in the sense of, like, wanting to take... Things not because it, they'll make me win, like, uh, but because I think it's a potentially interesting choice. That being said, should we sell uh, Ursa Major? Maybe. This is... Oh, okay. I was going to say, this is brutal. Still it. Still is. Oh, my God. That was such a tight, tight window for a jump. That room generation. Yikes. All right. This is super sketchy if we take this chest. But money where the mouth is, I guess. You know, there it, it's annoying. But how much damage is it? Thirteen. It, uh, you know, we got her some major. So throw speed. Okay. Yeah. Sure. This all being said, maybe we... Should I remove a curse instead of gaining a blessing? I, you know, it genuinely depends on what the options are. If there's nothing that exciting, I'm just gonna... 
I'm not wowed by that stuff. I, I'm removing just because it's not gonna it's not gonna move the needle in us getting Omegalol to show up if I pick up a blessing there. Instead of removing a curse. It's just it's not going to change it. So I might as well might as well remove the curse, I guess. See if we can get rid of something that's hampering us a little bit more than that. Don't get me wrong, crit damage is a great blessing, and I should have probably picked it up. Don't get me wrong, don't get me wrong. Yep, 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 yep. Good stuff, good stuff. Good stuff, good stuff. Say that you're good stuff. Good stuff, good stuff. I am the good stuff. We have a big discount time. Awesome. I'll, that That's a very, very good get. In the old removo sphere. Um, boy, we are... We're incredibly in debt. <laughs> Boy, we're in debt. Cool. Do we go pick up that throw speed? If we don't get Omegalol. Um, what? That was some garbage, but we're alive. We can do better. We can do better. <laughs> we can do better. <laughs> I'm such a dummy, dude. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, I'm so in debt. I'm in crushing debt, dude. It's okay. We're, it's on other mine seven. We should have picked up the uh, the gold dupe. That's when we should have stopped. That's when a sane person would have stopped. However, you know, Ursa Major plus this uh, this pendant, we can probably generate some pretty decent uh, throw damage out of it. So sure. <sighs> I want. I really would like to try and find Omegalol a second time today. I want to. I want to see if it's even possible in other mine. I'm sure it is, but I guess I don't have. I can't speak with authority on the matter. Cause I don't freaking know. We didn't need to do that second one yet. We could have waited to see that that was not going to be a secret room. Oh, bad idea. But a will, but a will. All right. Should we go to the shop when we are 1,500 in debt? Absolutely. Hmm. Hmm. Bombs will probably help us get out of debt, to be honest, but... I don't know, man. Should I spend four keys? Probably not. I don't. I still want to go in more, more in debt. And leftovers is certainly good. See, now that I see that we have Ursa, the Ursa Major and potential Archer's Pendant combo, assuming it works the same as the uh, the Swing Damage one, this could be really good. Where the more max HP we have, the more damage we do. I'm not sure if it is that way, but we'll definitely try. Uh, we could sell the credit card. Oh, we can't sell the credit card because it is not an option. Da -da. Da -da 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 -da. We could sell our credit card to get out of debt. Just like real life, we could do that. Right? Oop. Um, do I want to do that fight? Not really. I don't really want to. It could it could kill me. And we would s certainly run out of our Ursa Major for whatever that's worth. Doesn't want to do an Ursa Major run. Won't shut up about Ursa Major. There. I made your comment for you. 
straw man. Ooh. Yep. All right. So this should be just a one. It's just the one bop for. Oh. Um, I, it's less likely. Like, let's be real. It's less likely that we're going to be at critical health when we have Ursa Major. So. Sure. We'll rock that then, I guess. Nice. Still no rank three, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Still no rank three, yeah. Whoa. Ermegalol. Nope. Ermegirl Megalol. Yeah, here. All right. All right, so now we have the thing where if we gain a curse, a blessing, take damage, heal damage, and go to a secret room. That's right, we did put that there. Uh, then we're... Then we're good. We get an item. I'll try to do it. I'll do my best. There's some floors where it just doesn't really seem likely or possible. Ah, beans. Oops. <laughs> I was going into the water and never put out my fire. But it was already gone and I electrocuted myself. What a world. I don't know why I thought there could be a secret room there. Okay, gain a blessing and a curse. Took damage. I mean, we'll he we will find a piece of food on this floor, so we will heal. So we should get our we should get an item on this floor. That's pretty good. But yeah, we should get a guaranteed shrine. Oh, well, okay. If you say so, you took the uh, challenge part away, Mister. I could leave that there and come back for it right before the boss fight. Oh, the bounce back. Shoot. Okay. Uh, step one, do this. Step two, get that. <laughs> okay. Eh, boy, a 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 boy. Ew! Ew! <laughs> oh, why have you done this? Can't believe you've done this. Um, if there is a curse tag or two in a shop. We should dupe. Do a little dupe. Do a little dupe of the curse tags for me. Okay. I try to use that aggressively for the first time in ever. Okay. Uh, as much as the other one is like a nice concept, it flies in the face of uh, us wanting to potentially, you know, find a second Omega Lol. Uh, I'm gonna buy a piece of food for the road food for the road food for the road and I'm definitely not picking up galoshes we know for a fact that we passed the fire walkers so why would we get that it is a bad item for bad people Eesh. I don't know why. I guess maybe to make sure that we get our... Oh. Oh. Make sure we get our timer. Sure. 
We in there, we in there, we in there. And goodbye. <whistles> Clean. Clean and easy. Don't know why I thought there was even a chance that we would maybe not possibly get the timer. Sure. Ah, fine. Gives us another target. Interesting. Gives us another target for things to bounce off of. Maybe it could end up being good in a weird way, but not really. It's more just that it's not as bad on this run as it is on other runs. As opposed to like, oh, come on. All right. Well, we can gain a blessing. And we found a secret room by doing that. Hmm. Ah, we can gain a blessing this way, too. Blessing and a curse instead of using this to get our blessing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, shoot. Shoot, 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 shoot. This is hell. This is such a small room for this. Okay. Yikes. God, that sucked. Oh, God, that sucked. All right, so yeah, we, we need to get to a secret room. Shouldn't be too bad. Hey, that was kind of good. Hey, that's pretty good. Hmm. Maybe it wasn't such a weird concept after all to say that it could be beneficial. I was kind of just talking out of my butt a little bit. Not all the way. A little bit. All right. If we really, really wanted to get some Omega Lol action, we would take some stray curses. I'll take a stray curse. And it's gone. All right. I would have taken two. If I could have gotten through, like, gotten away with it semi-safely, I would have, I would have taken two. It's a shame we passed up a uh, wicked, wicked blade. Have we healed this floor? I'll get that on the way out. Oh, come on! Oh, it's so bad. No, oh, no. Oh, well. Oh, well. Oh, well. I heard on uh, the stream that they were, when they were raiding the items, right on that day that I said that they were going to be doing doing that, uh, and then they got to the point where they were going to talk about rat bond, rat bond, and then coincidentally someone in the chat had their own unique special idea that... What if Rat Bond made rats spawn from chests the day that I talked about it? You know? If that's one of you, congrats. I hope you're happy. <laughs> hope you're happy. <laughs> I hope you uh, I hope you are so super super proud of that whole credit that you're gonna not give me there on that idea. But alas, you know, I don't I don't care. I don't care. Who cares? Who'd care? Genuinely I am just more excited that if that idea gets in the game that'd be great because rat bond's so bad it's so bad there's no there's no two ways about it the item is just it's it's not in other mine it provides uh, I, it, it's one of the items that probably provides the least potential value possible like can you get value out of it yeah Right? Yeah. If you get it as your first item. But rats just don't spawn in other floors. Not really. After you're through the first floor, you don't... Oh, my God. Okay. Well, we got the curse. So... All right. Omega Lull, my boy. If you are out there, this is the last floor that you can show up. And boy, we've gotten some excess curses. I'll tell you that much for free. Okay. This is 
pretty good, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. What, what? Oh, we don't have any curses or any bombs. We have pl plenty of curses. Should we go into debt to remove that? Oh, you know what we should have done? Should we still remove two curses for free? Maybe. Yeah. Okay. So we got our curse. We can get a blessing too. I see that secret room. I'm just don't have any bombs. We can get a blessing from the shrine. We could do it that way. It's not a bad idea, I don't I would not say. Yep. Yeah, this is so nice. Holy moly. Spider Lord right here. We're genuinely Genuinely, we're making these spiders into almost a benefit. I actually think we are. What a world. Like, we're, we're kind of able to bounce things off of them in a way that is super handy to us. I don't think we need more than two keys. I'm not going to go into the four key room. There should be the shrine and an item room left. There's a four key bomb. There should be a four key Four key item room as well, but I'm probably not gonna. I, I'm not gonna get that. The only way I get into that is if I bomb my way into that. Hence what I've done. I thought there was a very real chance that that was going to be a secret room. But alas. Stay a while and listen, please. Um, you know, <laughs> I, <laughs> as much as the other item is a throw item, it's a bad throw item. It's not a good throw item. Sure. This one's free, so that makes that decision even easier. Oops. Yep. Spider Slayer. This is going to be a chain reaction from hell when this happens. Yup, what did I say? Wow. Thank you. More spiders, please? Because then I can actually... The thing is... Because then I can stay far away? And throw the pickaxe? It's... God, it's... So weird to me that it's actually pretty good... <laughs> to have them there. Spider Lord. Okay. Come on. It's... Just, it's not possible. All right. All right. Good stuff. Good enough stuff. Let's just go. Also, apparently, I went to the item room already. I don't know why I thought there was one left. And I'll admit that I did forget that we were on the we weren't on the last floor. I mean, I remember right at the end there, obviously, but. All right, so now we want to get a curse. It does not matter if we pick up blessings. There's no Omega Lol chance to worry about. No Omega Lol chance to worry about. We didn't get it. Is it possible? I, I you know, it's it's still a, an urban legend, but I imagine you theoretically can get Omega Lol twice. Oh my God. We, oh, I just realized we lost our uh, OP shield. Tis what tis. I'm actually, I kind of like that. Puts us in a little bit of a um, a spicier situation. Like I'll, I'll probably try and get it up back a little bit. But I kind of, I kind of like that. Pay for the whole seat, only use the edge kind of scenario. I, I'm happy that we brought it back into. You know, I'm not gonna say. I'm not going to say we're in the danger zone or anything, because we're certainly going to be just fine. But kind of, yeah, yeah, I'm cool with that. There we go. 
it's not quite such a guarantee that or we at least have to uh, get it back up buffed up because you know if you want to run where we have 2000 hp with uh with ursa major we've, we've done it before so get your butt out of a bunch uh, this will actually benefit us more due to our item Spiders! Spider Tamer? Spider Bane. I mean, there we go, right? I think we know. Oh, Spider Bane! Romulus Spider Bane. Now that is a freaking name and a title. I, I try not to do them early, but boy, I, that is a that one slaps. It's like a Sounds like a full on DND character. Oh, I don't like this if we can't kill you. Okay. That could. Oh. <laughs> could have been gross if we, we couldn't have killed that one in time. That would have been really potentially problematic for sure. Cool. Oh, I tried to hit it out of the air. Oops, it's the boss. Just kill that. Who cares? Who cares? We're out of debt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I don't want either of these. Break them. Romulus Spider Bane. This is how he goes. <laughs> Romulus Spider Bane. Oh my god. It's so good. It's so good. It's so good. Thank you, video game, for giving me that poetry. Th this is providing no value. Let me make that clear. This only serves to make things worse for us because of uh, the potential that we lose Ursa Major. Don't get me wrong. I know that. Wow! And as a reward, I get busted item. Sure. I'm gonna get food out of here. What do we get? Oh, <laughs> you. Oh, you. You got me. You got me good. You got me good. Should be a pretty solid boss for us to handle. Oops. Okay. Good. We love it. We love it when this boy splits in half there. Looking for that. Whoop. Ah, you piece of garbage. Looking for that quad there. Whoop. Yes. We're like getting lag due to the like weirdness of the uh, the on hit effect procs and everything. I guess the way that it's bouncing between everything so quickly and proccing all of the things. I don't know. But alas, that is that and that is going to do it for today. A huge shout out to Romulus Spiderbane. That is your title for the day. Oh my goodness. Thank you very much for the support, the very generous support on Patreon, getting your name on a peasant, helping support the channel. Anybody at the $5 tier or higher gets their name on a peasant in the next episode after their support. Check out the channel for Rogue Looks more every single day, and I will see you next time. Bye.